All right, greetings. This is Mike Vickery here in Florida with uh, with Mark Boggs. That's me. Bishop McNamara High School, Bradley Bourbon A High School. We're here to give you a little football message. Yep, Mark, football you message. Start? Yeah, I'm going to start, start, Mike. Mike, my brother here, longtime friend. Um, and, and here's the cool thing about it is that um, Bradley McNamara, when it comes to that, it's like it's it, it, it's a whole brotherhood thing and all of us have played together we've all played against each other i'm shouting out to guys like dave zanani jeff dental that i played with uh, and, and you played with those guys right joel supernaut joel donnie, supernaut. donnie, Pal donnie palisard yep exactly those guys and here well, here's what we're here to talk about we're here to talk about what's really important is bradley in a mac football game needs to happen again and here's why it needs to happen again because I remember when I played in those games, and I always loved that time because it was the first game of the year, and and because it was the first game of the year, that was like the equivalent of Notre Dame playing Michigan. You know, I mean, it was just atmosphere. You know what I'm saying, Mike? It was at, <laughs> it was, that was at, it, baby. it was atmosphere. That was it. I never forget. I'll still never forget to this day. I always like to play at Mac. I hate to say that, but I did always like to play at Mac because. There were people freaking everywhere. There, the, the place was packed. There would be six people deep all the way around the track or all the way around the football field. Six people deep. And when we would come out of the locker room to go to the go to the game or to go into go into the 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 football field, there was just people everywhere on both sides. It was like a heavyweight fight. Is what it was like. It was like you know back in the day, a heavyweight fight. And, 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 and just the whole atmosphere of that is something that I think that the Kankakee area needs. I mean, it's something that's so important. And I, 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 we are so grateful to have, you know, the thing that we had back in the day of just, just that game. And it's something we all look forward to all summer. We would work out all summer. And McNamara was our first game of the year. And we looked, we worked our butts off, weight room, um, sprints, all, you know, all of that stuff that we would do during that lead up to that game. That was it. I mean, that was, that was a motivation. You know what I mean? Mark, we had three seasons. You had your all city season, you had your conference or independent season, and then you had playoffs. Yep. So you had three things to look forward to. And the first thing was all city. The first thing was all city. And you know what? If it didn't work out for you, you could still salvage your conference and your state, your your state playoff run. Yeah. You know. So you had three things that you'd look forward to. Yeah. And and now, you know, really, the challenge is to get the coaches and to get the athletic directors. The challenge is, the only people who are losing are the kids. Yeah. Absolutely. The only people who are losing are the kids because we're sitting here. And it's 35, 37 years later, and we're sitting in a bar in Florida, it's actually and we're talking, yeah. we are talking about Bradley Mack football games. Yeah, absolutely. So you know what? No one talks about playing Andrew. No one talks about playing Bloomington Central Catholic. Yeah. No one talks about any of that. What you talk about is Bradley, Kankakee, and McNamara. Yeah, absolutely. So you know what? The coaches and the athletic directors, your challenge is to put your petty differences aside, quit robbing these kids of memories, yeah. and get this done. Because you know what? If anything has taught us anything from this whole COVID nonsense, yeah. is the only thing we have is our relationships yeah. and our memories. Yeah. That's all we have. Yeah. So you know what? Get it done. Yeah. Figure it out. And you know what? Joel Supernaut, if we want to go out Thanksgiving Day, next thanksgiving and play another mcnamara bradley game i would be happy to knock you on your ass again i'll be happy to like limp out there on like a bad <laughs> hip and do that i'll be fine with that <laughs> bring uh, it on soupy yeah, now there's guys out there too that uh, i want to shout out to some bradley guys there's dave bass dave i know that you played in a bunch of these mac bradley games and you definitely would have a feeling on this um there are so many other guys Jeff Humphrey, we, you know, Jeff, you were a freaking star back in these days. Uh, not that you aren't nowadays, because I think you're one of my heroes. Woody Humphrey, all these Bradley guys, you guys know 
exactly what this game was. Mike Van Mill, David Buck, Tim Hyland, oh, Chuck yeah. Buck. Yeah, all you absolutely. guys. Yeah. All you guys. You know, everybody, if we can get this game done, show up. Hell, I'll show up. Everybody I'll come, show up. I'll come back and here you know from what? Florida. Let's and all I'll walk go. out to the captain's thing and let's all shake hands. Yeah. Because that's what it's about. So you know what? All the administrators or coaches or whoever's making this game not happen, put your petty stuff aside and make yep. it happen. Put it a, Get put it a, done. This is this is Get for, it the, done. for the kids. These guys, Mike and I have been sitting here talking. And you know what? What's all, so awesome about this is our great memories of these games that we shared together. You know, Mike was from Mac. I was from Bradley. Back in the day, we all hated each other, which was great. That was what it was all about. You know what I'm saying? And we played the game. And, yeah, so in my years, Mac always won. And I'll give kudos to, to, to guys like Dave Zanani and, and, and Mike Van Mill and Jeff Dennell and those guys who had some awesome football teams, a state championship team. Wish I would have had that. Never did. But one of my cherished memories, though, is I got to take part in three varsity Mac Bradley games, and I'll never forget this. And I played in the freaking NFL. So I, I'm, I still believe that, that, that these Mac Bradley games are essential. Bogsy, let's go, let's go do a board line drill. Loser buys beers. You <laughs> I'll have, win. You have, you have half a hip, so I at least have half a chance. <laughs> so we're going. Yep, absolutely. Peace out. Peace out.